I'm the guard dog of this place. I guard this place so that all shall pass. Er, make that none shall pass. Hello guys, I'm the Gamer Raider 10 and welcome back to more Let's Play Okami. In the last episode, we got the new we got a new power in Whirlwind from catching a marlin for the chef Umi. We we also got the What? Okay, I swear something was rising up. We also finally finished that side quest with Mr. Sheik and the and the girl, and we finally, finally made it down to the Dragon Palace. In this episode, I know it looks small, it's basically a palace in Japan. Now, the Dragon Palace looks similar to somewhere we've already been. You have that long corridor, you have this leading up. You have these rooms on the side. Oh right, this is a merchant. Oh? Since when did they let dogs into the Dragon Palace? Still, I'm not one to turn my nose up at a customer, even a dog. This is the palace's treasure vault, and I'm the vault keeper. But everything's got its br- Alright, see? Wanna buy anything? So you're selling royal treasure, Dude, okay. The two striped snappers, we don't have the marlin since, since we know where that went. It'd be kind of weird if we had another marlin inexplicably in our inventory. Alright, you have... you're a general merchant. Okay. You don't have anything special for us. Uh, okay. You don't call this Dragon Palace for nothing, the bottom of the sea is just heaped with sunken treasure. Okay, you soon control yourself. He's trying to steal it. Uh, you're already trying to st you're already trying to steal that floor was inconsistent. You're already trying to steal our brush techniques. You don't need to steal anything else. All right, going through here. Uh, ooh, treasure chest. I think this contains. I thought it contained a crystal, but it's a exorcism slip pass. Come on, we've graduated from exorcism slip passes. How do they? How can they even have scrolls underwater? Is there a paper that works underwater? Oh, there is a paper that works underwater. Flex tape! It even works underwater! <sighs> what on earth is happening to the Dragon Palace these days? Our dragon going mad and the forces of darkness invading? There's no end of worry that some things going on. I think you... I think they basically say the same thing. Although I think one of them is complaints about the She has a pet octopus! What the I think they basically say, you know, oh, we don't usually talk with we don't usually have contact with the surface world. But anyway, you have those there. Alright, remember how I said it looks familiar? You know, those room up top, that corridor over there. He me okay, what is oh, what is on one of the answers you want the wolf? She's upstairs in the throne room now. Check it out. An elevator into the throne room. This place is a recolor of Sasa Sanctuary. Man, and I thought the engine room was full of copies and ripoffs. Unfortunately, she doesn't have any presents for us, considering we didn't exactly save a daughter of hers, but you know. Welcome, both of you. Welcome to the Dragon Palace. You are in the kingdom of the Dragonians now. I couldn't care less who or what you are. All I'm interested in is that lady sitting on a rump over there. That's your leader, right? Well, we have some choice words for her. Yes, it is I, Otohime, ruler of the Dragon Palace and leader of the Dragonians. Leader of the Dragonians, Otohime. soon. <clears throat> anyway, we wanted to ask you something. You know that water dragon that's been running amok lately? It's under your control, right? Well, why don't you keep that thing on a leash? It was with sending your emissary to come get us. Are you really that desperate? The Dragonians are prepared to do whatever is necessary. I like how her tassels bounce around when, she, when her head moves. Amaterasu, origin, origin of all that is good and mother to us all. You are not a brush god! What the? You know about Ami? The water dragon is our guardian deity and protector of the seas. It kept the peace by pacifying chaos wherever it reared its head. But that all changed just one month ago. 
Oni Island, the dark place of ancient legend, suddenly appeared. Evil beings swarmed into the sea and laid siege to the Dragon Palace. One month ago is roughly, in terms of canon, around the same time that Orochi started coming back. We mustered our forces to battle, but the enemy was too strong. Most of our realm fell into the hands of the forces of, K of, Dar of Darkness. Come on. It was then that the Water Dragon appeared. With overwhelming strength, it routed the enemy's forces. But the enemy's leader, the Dark Lord, had unimaginable powers. The Water Dragon nearly fell in the face of his onslaught. So grave were his wounds that he flew into an uncontrollable rage. The Dark Forces then pulled back from the sea, leaving behind these chaotic waters plagued by the rampaging dragon. So you're saying that control of the water dragon, we never had control of the water dragon. It is our guardian deity, but its madness now endangers us as much as anyone else. You've got to be kidding me. The water dragon is supposed to break the barrier on Oni Island. What hope do we have of attacking the enemy if it won't help us? Indeed, there is little hope left. It appears that all has gone as the Dark Lord planned. I don't want to talk to the security guard. I want to talk to Otohime. So I have to listen to her royal highness once more? Sure. Death through the seas. He kept the peace by pacifying chaos from the reared's head. I'll change just a month ago. I think there's something distant. I think there's something different now. So the water dragon appeared. Amy's, Amy's leader. So great for his wounds. What's more, we've heard it already. Ah, we don't need to hear all that stuff again. You tell her, soon. We can't break the barrier on Oni Island without the water dragon. Himiko prayed so long and hard to locate that dang island, and now he can't even get on it. Come on, Ami. You're a god, ain't you? Then you have some secret weapon hidden up your sleeve. Please, wait. It is true we cannot control the water dragon. However, there is still a way to harness its power. Is? Then why didn't you just say so? It is a deed of last resort and fraught with grave danger. Alas, it is beyond our power. That is why we summoned you, Amaterasu. You probably just want us to go tie a leash around the dragon, right? We're not going to do anything crazy like that. It's not like we couldn't pull it off or anything. Right, right, Ami? I mean, Orca would probably help us out, right? This deed of last resort is as follows. We must retrieve the dragon orb. Dragon orb? What's that? So you're saying we can just forget about the water dragon and go hunt for the dragon orb thing? Sounds like a piece of cake. I mean, we're treasure hunting pros. You already know the location of the dragon orb. It lies in the belly of the water dragon. You must enter the water dragon's body. Come again? The dragon orb is the new essence of the water dragon's power. With it in my possession, I could easily break through the barrier that protects Oni Island. Will you not enter the water dragon through its gaping jaws and retrieve the dragon orb that lies deep in its belly? With it, I could break the barrier that protects Oni Island. N now wait just a second, lady! Go get some orb from the water dragon's stomach? Are you nuts? That is the only way left to break the barrier on Oni Island. Will you not enter the water dragon through its gaping jaws and retrieve the dragon orb? With it, I could break the area that protects Oni Island. Whoa, slow down there, sister. I make it a habit of never saying no to a pretty face. But if my boss here says no, there ain't much I can do. Well, boss, we gonna help this chick or what? Help out Tohime, we don't really have a choice. Bummer. Well, the boss has spoken. Huh? But, but Ami! Oh, great Amaterasu, your compassion is truly as deep as the sea. You are ever quick to decide. This amulet will allow you to enter the water dragon's garden. Oh, uh, I thought the shell amulet was like the size of an actual like uh, the size of the magic conch for instance, for instance, but no, she just wears it around her neck. Water Dragon's Garden? So something about an octopus is never mind. I if I knew the lyrics I would sing it. That is correct. The water dragon makes its lair in a garden here at our palace. Here. At this palace. That thing lives here. It does, but it will not attack us as long as we leave it be. 
doubt we would come out alive if we entered its lair. I truly believe that Hamaterasu can retrieve the Dragon Orb. I shall pray for your safe return. Yep. Look at the mess we're in now. Why are you always so eager to please? Ah, oh, forget it. Let's go get that barrier that barrier breaking orb. The water Dragon's Garden should be around here somewhere. We have to enter the water dragon to get the orb. If you're wondering, down here is where we have to go. I lied, it's actually down here. Yeah, it's down here where we have to go. Notice the dragon symbol on the door? Oh, you've got a shell amulet. Means Otohimi must have found you worthy. Forgive my rudeness. You may pass. I believe here, Isu says. No, and I didn't want to go in here just yet. This is the, That's the water dragon's garden. But there is somewhere else we can go. Down this way. Alright, you've got a shell amulet. So you have the permission of Otohime? Uh, excuse me. I'll give my rudeness. You may pass. He still doesn't say it. Okay. Isun does say something while we're down here. Anyway, check out all check out all of these girls. Uh, real quick though, I want to I said real quick I okay, to be fair, that right there I just did randomly. Vengeance slip. Okay, up here we have a clover. Don't ask me how there's a clover down here, but you know, are we? Hang on, are we tiny or am I insane? No, we're, we're not tiny. What? Why is this clover so big? Am I, I don't know if I'm crazy or not, but... Anyway, and check it out. For I think the first time since we left Taka Pass, we're using rejuvenation. Which is really interesting. The reason why you want to bring that drum back is because up here is a stray bead. I actually finished editing episode 29 last night, so we're actually halfway done with the game, so that's pretty interesting. At least with stray beads. Got a bullhorn for our troubles. <coughs> our troubles! Talk to this... Dude? Spring up, Le spring up, spring, Lulu! Spring up, spring, Lulu! Lulu land! Lulu land! Is it just me or the others singing something different? But water dragon's causing havoc now that it's settled in the in the palace. It snores so loud, and every time it stirs, there's an earthquake. I don't know if that's why, but our swirly whirly springs dried up. There's a space between spring and that apostrophe. What the heck? Us dance troop girls have been ordered to do a water dance. This dance won't get any spring flowing again. No, I said we need to smash through the rock under the spring. If you hit water, that would get the spring going again. Only someone would help and dig a hole where the spring was. Luckily. We can do that. We can do just that. What do you say, Isu? Some seriously hard rock here. I beg you to dig through it if you practice enough. Alright. Oh! Why are you digging this dried, dried up spring, doggy? Hoping to smash the rock under the spring to find water, are you? You must have a good nose on you. That was my plan, too. Her belly jiggled. What? Come on, then, doggy. Help me dig down under the spring. Yep! Guess what we get to do? I'll see if we can smash through the rock and revive the spring. Yes, I want to help dig up the spring. This is the worst of the digging mini games. You guys are pretty good at digging. Once I'm down to the deepest rock, I'll hit it as hard as I can. Just focus on digging. Get me down to the deepest point. Got it? Or do you want me to explain that again? I don't need the explanation again. All right. Don't let me down. Here's here's what we get to see. Look what happens. We start off all the way down at the bottom. That dancer is up is up at the top. We have to make our way to the top and bring that dancer down. Remember how I said when we were... I think when we were doing Kaguya or Bingo's game that there was a... Digging mini game where we had to do that? This is what I was talking about. Though, you'll probably be excited, or at least I'll be excited to know, this is the last digging mini game. A... Friggin' men. The good news is they give you 
six minutes, so you have ample time to do this. But still, it's really tedious, and it's probably... It's not the best if you don't know what to do. Like, if you don't know, you can use cherry bombs. Okay, good, sorry, I just... Was, I just wanted to make sure that I was... Oh, excuse me, that was... I don't want to dig that out, actually. I just wanted to make sure I was still recording, just if something bad happened. <clears throat> also, with how... With how the, um... With how the... Trial Demon Gate didn't spawn... I've actually been committing a sin when it comes to Let's Playing. Never ever save... Never ever overwrite your per your well your personal save file, but never ever overwrite save files while you're recording because you never know what could happen. Like beyond your control. Um, I'd like to see if I could go through this without blooming any giant buds, but our time is about a third up. The good news is, ow! The good news is at least at least that sing that, at least that drummer. At least that dancer isn't, um, at least she's not walking into, into, um, you know, at least she's not walking into spikes up there. That would be just plain cruel. Got a little bit of breathing room. I think we're nearing the top, I want to say. Also, how is there no water down here, anyway? Um, I don't need it again. It's whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Um, do it. We'll make this cherry bomb here. Damn it! Wanted it. Wanted it to. It's inside the rock, but it didn't blow up. Okay. I think this is the top. Yeah, this is definitely the top. There we go. Okay. I want to see if actually I didn't need to get the... You're gonna hit the spikes. We're gonna hit the spikes. Come on, get up. Get up. Get up, thank you. What? Ugh. Okay, fine. Ah, okay, fine. I'm done here, okay? Jeez. Uh, how is her sky... Where are these minigames located on on the world map? Are they their own map or what? That's actually kind of curious. No, it hasn't been lost on me the androgynous nature of of this of this dancer. Okay, I just didn't feel like I needed to make a mention of it since it was a plainly obvious. B well. I didn't want to exact. I didn't want to bring too much attention to it since. Yeah, that's really about it. It just was a little obvious. I'm not trying to get into political arguments, and yes, I do support the LGBT community. So, let's see. Anyway, I'm not gonna get into politics. That's a. De Stop getting hit on the spikes. This is not a political channel. I have zero intentions of making this a political channel except for gaming stuff like with my Switch Force video. Okay, moving forward. There we go. We're down to the bottom. It didn't really matter if we got the, um... If we got the whatchamacallits. There we go. We did it. We win. Yeah, right on! Wahoo! I smashed right through that rock! And look at that, the spring's gushing again! Uh, spring's running again, but... Huh? Feels like something was supposed to happen. This isn't good. The swirly whirly is missing. The world's gone. Exactly! It's the swirly whirly that's kept us all in good health up to now. Without it, we'd lose the will to live. I have lost the will to live. Seeing there's nothing more to give. Okay. Anyway, enough. Just whining about it's not going to help, is it? 
Everyone, we've got to summon the Swirly Whirly back again. We'll transfer our passion and enthusiasm into the spring by running around as fast as we possibly can. Look at her go! Look at her! She's outspeeding these thinner g Wow, okay. What we gotta do is basically draw a whirlwind in the water. And there we go. If we remember that one nature girl over in Taka Pass mentioned how mermaids would sometimes come up from the Dragon Palace up to Taka Pass, this is what she was talking about. Origin of all that is good and mother to us all. Followers in need and your own pure heart have restored my power. I, Nuregami, have a new power to bestow upon you. I have harnessed the fervent energy of those in need to create the power called Fountain. Use it well. Fountain is pretty cool. It's essentially Mist Warp, but for mermaid fountains. The Swirly Whirly's return to the spring. The Swirly Whirly spring. Spring's real name is the Swirling Spring. It's a portal to the connect to the. Dra it's a portal to the Dragonian. It's a it's a portal the Dragonians made to connect to the land. You jump in when it's swirling, you can go to different places. Sometimes we girls use it to get out and have some fun on land. Oops, you won't tell Otohime about that, will you? I mean, thanks for all your help, doggy. Here, have this. You'll be surprised at what's inside. Mermaid coins are now obsolete. You can sp you can go ahead and... I knew it, but strength is the only answer in the end. Now the da Dragon Palace dan dance troops motto is muscle. Oh, well, good luck with that. Boy, I mean, that's my mean brush you wield. You can summon one of those travel whirlpools anytime you want it when you if you use that mer technique on a mermaid spring. Now I can travel across the Nippon for free. You guys, it pays to help people every now and again. Every now and then. I wouldn't say sell your mermaid coins just yet, because you can maybe use them in New Game Plus, but for now, you don't really need to buy anymore unless you have... unless you have that. So, yeah, we can just activate Mermaid Springs by drawing on them. It's really, really spring with its swirly whirly. It's the most amazing spring in the world! Alright. We have that going for us. Now, 22 minutes on the clock, we're going to be making story progress. Sorry about that, my back is murdering me. Because I'm, si I'm sitting here. That's not ominous at all. Hmm? What the? It's a pesky water dragon. How many times did that rampaging sea monster almost finish us off? So it makes its home here, eh? That's one nasty- that's one huge nasty looking mouth on that thing. Think we could really go in there and come back out alive? I mean, we're not talking about the Emperor's stomach here. Yeah, it's just chilling here. We could go down there right now, but there's something- There is something a little bit more important right now that requires our attention. Glass beads, but that's not the kind of bead that I'm talking about. What I'm talking about is a bead of the stray variety. Alright. Doesn't look like there's anything else. There is something more to this garden, but it's not going to be important until a little bit later. And an infinity stone. Temporarily enjoy infinite ink. Anyway, like Eason says, leap before you think. Good thing it's Joss didn't snap, sna didn't snap close in the split second that it would have taken to finish us off. Inside the dragon. Well, here we are. It's the water dragon's stomach, huh? It's just me or is it unbearably hot and humid in here? Hmm. The way this dragon is running amok. I'm sure we'll, so we'll see all sorts of gruesome things down here. I just hope I don't lose my lunch. You're really gonna find that dragon arm in here, Ani? I do not want to think about what these trees are, and even worse, you can cut these trees down and it bleeds. Yeah. Uh, something you mentioned about the water dragon's stomach. Point of no return. Once you once you clear the area, you will never be able to come back here. As such, there are no stray beads nor sun fragments. Good news is, this is actually a relatively short dungeon. It's Hana Valley size, if you will. 
Alright, more pearls inside of oysters inside of oysters. Okay. Not what I had in mind. Is that crystal there? That looks really weird with the way the power slash looks when it was paused. Leave on us. Very, very nice. Let's dig you up. Well, oh, oysters in here. Excuse me. Right, there's still more oysters. Jeez, man. Alright, extra system slip S. Alright, real question is I'm trying to get as many treasures as I can throughout here because, again, not gonna be able to come back once we leave here. Whoa! Blue Demon Scroll? Sure, why not? I think this is a. Chimera, oddly enough. Okay, you're dead. Whoa, you're dead too. Okay. There we go. Alright. Three Demon Fangs. Very nice. Take care of you. Go through here. Do I want to fight that demon scroll? Yeah, that's a mystery for you guys to solve. All right. Engine slip. As you can say, we're really giving it the slip. All right. Anyway, um, not over there. There is a secret around here. I won't lie to you. This place is actually really pretty. As Gross as this place seems, it's actually really weirdly pretty. Still soul sake. I wonder what those waterfalls are. I know this is water that we're, ste we're stepping around in, but what are those waterfalls? I just says I'm slip M. Okay, you're there. Aha! Here's the thing in Okami, Steel Fist Sake. Here's the thing in Okami. If there's a waterfall, there's probably treasure behind it. Well, this isn't really treasure so much as it is a utility, but, you know. This helps out immensely. Bring this up here. I won't lie, I actually really like this song. I think this song is simply called Stomach of the Water Dragon or the Water Dragon Song. It's... It's the Water Dragon's stomach. The song. I don't know what the hell I'm saying. What I, what I am saying is that this is a really nice song. Alright, go over here. Oh, I'm sorry I'm yelling so much. Oh, this right here? We haven't seen this before? This fully heals you and restores you. It's basically... And restores your ring. It's basically like stepping in, into an origin mirror, but without the saving. Anyway, sorry I'm yawning so much. I only got like six hours of sleep last night. I know that's like heaven to some people, but me personally, it's bad. Isun was right. We are seeing gruesome sights here. Another crystal. What is with all these crystals? Yeah, there's a skull too. It's really grim. As beautiful as this place is, it does betray just how grim this place is. Ah, it's like Hana Valley, but mirrored. But I don't like Hana Valley. There's this guy up here. Did you complete the murder of Sonic the Hedgehog? Because if not, well... I'm not gonna say you're missing out, but... Still a pretty good game in its own right. Hmm? What's that? All tangled up in this flabby stomach muscle. Oh, stop yawning. It's like a glass ball or something. Hmm. Can't really do a whole lot about this. We can try power slashing, but no dice. Ah, we'll budge. Water Dragon sure doesn't want to give this thing up. Must be something really important. I think we're coming up on the timer, so. Now that we've reached this kind of checkpoint in the 
water dragon's stomach. Actually, hang on. Oh, this is how you examine it. Glass ball or something. Wait a second. I wonder if it's... Could that be the dragon orb? Anyway. Now we've reached this, po this point in the water dragon's stomach. I think we're going to call it quits for this episode, alright? So, next time on Let's Play Okami, we're going to see if we can get this thing free. It's safe to assume that this is the dragon orb. Dragon orb? What? It's safe to assume this is a dragon orb. We're going to see if we can get that dragon orb free and make off with it. Alright, see you guys in the next episode.